Hey, why don't you come join me and walk through my week with me? I'm cool. Hey, hi, how are you? It's Crystal again. It's Friday, the 18th. I'm going to throw in a bunch of clips of my week. Um, I didn't post anything on two, Wednesday. Tuesday or Wednesday. Could have been both of them. Didn't do a video for this weekly wrap-up because I wasn't feeling good. And I didn't do any on Thursday because I was feeling okay. But I was with Hopi all day. And so there's like a couple pictures I'll throw in. But other than that, nah. Good morning. It's Saturday. It's still morning. Barely still morning. About an hour left of morning, but I have to be at work when that hour switches over. Um, I'm working seven out of the next eight days. Today isn't technically on next week's schedule, but if you combine today's hours with next week's hours, it'll be a total of 58 hours on the clock. Uh, sinuses and allergies are still kicking my rear end. While there is a sleet storm and windstorm outside. So, yay! Um, I knocked out one of the placemats for my sister this morning. I'll have this coaster and another placemat. Well, this coaster will be done and another placemat will probably be started before I leave for work. But I thought I would do that, like, super, super quick. Hey, this is my Saturday because by the time I get home tonight... I'm not going to want to um, film anything because tomorrow morning I have to be back at work. And, you know, if, like I, I'm not even sure if the sun will completely be up by then. Sorry for the sniffling. I sound like a little kid. I'll see you tomorrow. <coughs> Sunday? Yeah, Sunday. Um, About 8 o'clock at night-ish. I worked all day. My allergies and my sinuses are still kicking my rear end, as I'm sure you can probably tell from this and my voice and my sniffling. Um, I worked the last two days feeling absolutely miserable, but did my entire shifts both days. I have a 50-hour work week ahead of me, and I pulled an extra 45 minutes today than I was supposed to. So we'll see where that goes. Um, I was going to do a what I got in my Misfits box and food prep today, but um, I was too busy and also too lazy <laughs> to do so. Instead, I came home and I've been crocheting and trying to rest and taking meds and Sis made dinner, and I ate, and I cleaned a little bit, and I took a shower, but I've only been home since about 5.30ish, so yeah, two and a half hours, and I looked at the time, and I was like, I, I don't feel like roasting vegetables tonight. I still have leftover rice, leftover noodles. Still have some veg made up. So instead of doing food prep for the week, I am going to let that rest until tomorrow when I'm off of work. Which hopefully will be around 4.30ish. Hopefully. But for now, I'm going to take some more medicine. And I'm going to crochet. I'll see you guys tomorrow. It's probably going to wobble quite a bit because of where I've got it. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, I'm not doing a food prep video this week because I sound like this. Uh, I probably won't do anything until the actual Friday when all of this gets posted. However... I'm still working every day at the moment. At the moment. It's it's Monday. <laughs> On a 50-hour work week. 
It started yesterday, and I ended up having to stay awake yesterday, and I don't feel great, and my sinuses and my allergies are kicking my rear end. However, the update I had for you guys right this minute, and the whole reason I started the video, is right then and there, that little bit right there means that all 12 of my sisters, Sunflower Coasters, and Placements, and her big one, are all done. Other than weaving in the last little ends and pressing it. I don't have any gross actual mess going on at the moment. I just don't feel good because whatever's in the air is causing my allergies to go insane. And my sinuses to do the same. I have a long shift tomorrow. Of which I will do at least 99% of. I don't feel great. It's not even 8 o'clock right now. However, I worked almost 9 hours today. I feel yucky enough to the point where I hope he cooked waffles and bacon for supper. She made me coffee. She made me tea. <coughs> and before I start another coffee bit for my sinuses draining down my throat, I'm signing off for the day. Bye bye, Monday. Okay. <laughs> that was squeaky. Okay, before I lose too much more light or the ability to make noise because it's been going on and off all day. Um, it's Tuesday. Last night I did end up doing some food prep for myself for the week, but I didn't do a video on it because I'm not feeling great. So I sauteed up some mushrooms, uh, summer squash, and tiny, tiny bits of broccoli. Um, and before that was fully sautéed, I added like half of that into two different containers with some fresh tomato, noodles, about a third of a can each of tuna, um, some mayonnaise, and some seasoning. And then I threw another tomato into what I was already sautéing, and then that went into three different containers, one with noodles, two with rice, the one with noodles got the other third of a can of tuna fish, the other two got five pieces of shrimp each from one of the containers of shrimp I had from work, and then the rest of the vegetables, well not the rest, the rest that I did last night, which was one sweet potato, the rest of the summer squash, and the rest of the giant head of broccoli, I, uh, roasted off in the oven and that's sitting in a bowl currently for me to do something with later on this week um there's like 12 out of 15 apples left that were delivered on sunday um there's no or oranges left no onion no garlic but I do still have two sweet potatoes. I ended up having to throw out the eggplant. I just didn't use it quick enough, even though it's only Tuesday. Um, we had weird weather over the weekend, so they were expecting it to be a little bit warmer, I think, when they delivered it. And then the eggplant was like, it got shocked with cold. It was out there for a little bit longer than it probably would have normally been. Got brought in, got left in the box, and no. So it ended up having to be tossed. We are also down to three of the breakfast muffins I did. I need to go to the store and get, sorry for the snippling, some more chocolate chips because the only thing I'm missing for my breakfast cookies is enough chocolate chips to make them so that I can use up the bananas we have left. However, I didn't go to work today because I woke up and I had a fever and I couldn't barely talk. And I was dizzy, and so I called into work. And then 
they wanted me to see if I could try to come in this afternoon, but I still, I, I, I'm, I still got like a mild fever and I'm not feeling great. So no, I need the rest instead of working. Um, I chose me over going to work. I don't often do that. I did today. So, uh, tonight I'm making, and the reason I'm doing this real quick for an update, I'm making, uh, I have chicken roasting in the oven. I'm about to do my dishes real quick so that I can break that chicken up a little bit when, it, when I'm ready to do it and put it in my frying pan with some, um, either stewed or diced tomatoes. I like to use the ones that have the, like, peppers and onions and seasoning in it already. Um, I haven't looked to see which kind I have right now, but I also have salsa. Basically, I'm just making chicken tacos because I have the chicken, I have the tortillas, I have the tomatoes, I have the salsa, I have cheese, and I have sour cream. So, the girls wanted chicken tacos, and that's what we're going to have tonight. Um, I've already eaten half of one of my tuna noodle mayo yumminess things um, because my appetite's not gone, but my throat hurts because my sinuses are draining because of the weather change. My allergies are kicked up even though there is absolutely no pollen in the air according to the weather forecast, but something in the air is causing my allergies to act up and my eyes are getting swollen and icky. I think I'm developing a sinus infection because of the drainage. I get them. I have my whole life. But it's also yesterday was cold in the morning, mildly warm in the afternoon. It's almost 70 degrees out still, and it's like 6 o'clock at night. So, yeah, bonus, my Apple clock is now back on correct time because of daylight savings time. I don't like daylight savings time. Can we just stay at this time all year? That'd be great. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I don't feel good. I'm going to do these dishes up real quick, see if my chicken's done, and then go rest for a little bit before I finish cooking. Bye. Kind of on my tiptoes right now. Not sure how well you can hear me. Mixing up chicken tacos, which is just chicken meat and the diced tomato and salsa. Some seasonings like garlic and onion and chicken seasoning and pepper. And then a little bit of water. I need a little to do. And some butter to kind of tame it out and not make it sick. My chicken didn't bake all the way even though it was in the oven for an hour. Sometimes that happens either the inside is too frozen or whatever. Because I only took it out today to defrost. But we went on a short walk. Whether that was advisable or not with me feeling like this, I don't know. But we did. And I don't know if it was earlier before Sis got home from school. But she didn't remember seeing it after school. And it certainly wasn't there when we came back for a walk. And I didn't look when I was leaving. But Sis's bike has been stolen. Could have been anybody from the surrounding area. Anybody just walking around. Because you could see our, our patio deck from, you know, the street behind us. And the buildings behind us. So, yeah. But, you know, she's not upset about it too bad. Because she says whoever took it probably needed it more than she did and um that's all fine and good should it have been in the storage unit of course but i've taught the girls pretty much their whole lives if somebody has the need to take something from you that doesn't belong to them but they don't do it in a violent manner therefore by causing you harm or anybody else harm an object can be replaced and obviously they needed it more than you did. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe that's not true. Maybe it is. But objects can be replaced. People can't. That's my my little TED Talk for Tuesday night. I don't know what my hair is doing. I don't really care. I'm all finished cooking. Have a good night, guys. The neighbor came over with video. From the surveillance cameras, apparently some random guy came down to the back of the house with a bike, went upstairs oh, to visit somebody, I guess, because they were gone for a while. I think he said something like 35 minutes and came back down with our bike and went down the alley to a wheelie. 
So, uh, I hope they enjoy it. I'm not even worried about calling the cops. I don't care. It can be gone. Obviously, he needed it more than we did, either because he wanted to ride it or because it was a better bike than the one he left. We're not keeping the one he left either. We're just going to leave it downstairs and see what happens. So that was my week. Um, I did call off the one day. I still ended up with like... Let me do the math. Three, four, so I was scheduled 50, and even with calling off, I did 46 hours at work. <laughs> That's okay, though. I hope you guys had an amazing day at work. Or at work? Well, yes, if you had to go to work, I hope you had an amazing day at work. Hope you had an amazing week, an amazing day. Next week. The schedule for me is looking amazing. I can't wait, and I still pretty much have a full-time schedule, but that's okay. And spring is springing. It's like, I can't say it's sprung yet, but it's springing because some of the trees have, like, buds on them. I can't wait at all for, you know, leaves and green and spring. And today was, like, 70 degrees or more. Wow. Anyway, guys, I will see you in my next video. Not exactly sure when I'm going to do that one. Might be Sunday. Might not be till next Friday. Don't quote me. Have an amazing time, guys. Bye.